What's up fam, it's your boy Shaquille Sama. we're back in the banger. If you didn't subscribe, please do subscribe, like this video and comment down below if it added value. Now guys, this video is going to be about how to use your Meta 34. If you don't, if you don't know how to use Meta 34 to execute your trades on, I'm going to share that with you guys. How to use Meta 34 for Forex traders, okay? Let's start from the beginning. Yeah, let's start. So, okay, do understand if from the beginning this this. Uh, we had to open up a demo account to show you guys how to use this okay so you download me the 304 uh, on apple store or you're gonna use um google, google play so you go in okay there you go and you're gonna get for this for for apple okay so apple will look like to have like quotes charts trade history and settings and it'll be similar for the Android as well don't look exact same but you will have uh, the same something similar that at the bottom and um, what you do is go to settings and you will click on new account and then for you guys that have existing uh, live accounts you click over here and you search your brokerage over there right for the ones history in demo you want to add your demo account as well what you do is just open demo account you search there and then you log in once it's logging it will show you logins over here uh, your name your login your account number live or, or demo and then over here the history will show all the trades that you have taken okay so that can be like a journal for you then the trade over here will show any existing trades that you are currently in as well as your account balance over here and the currency it's in and then over here which is the charts which will show simply charts okay and on the top to have a trade and then quotes this will be the quotes over there and if you want to add make it simple to look like that and uh, if you want to maybe add anything more over there uh you can say yes did you add nasdaq already mm -mm. so what's nasdaq under here nasdaq let's say indices like um what is it now yeah here we go and let's say you want to add nasdaq yes you can 100 nasdaq 100 okay we added boom look done and there's nasdaq 100 so you want to trade it you click on it it says trade over there you trade and that will be your lot size that will be a stop loss that will be a take profit it will be similar on uh, android it will have a, a stop loss in red and a take profit in green or blue one of the two it's exactly the same you add you enter your stop loss over there and you take profit over there so let's say example we want to enter trade on nasdaq right we just say uh your lot size same lot size one lot and we want to take a um let's say you take a sell if i say sell you take a sell right done and there you can see we're in a trade now if you want to maybe uh close the trade you slide or tap on it and right you slide and then pencil uh no, let's click it and close there we go if you want to enter another trade maybe a buy okay done there you can see and then maybe you want to uh modify it meaning you want to add in a stop loss in you go there with a the pencil and add your stop loss in and modify there we go that's basically how we use with trade of four very easy simple step to the point thank you guys once again sign up should kill someone